Where do we begin? The Sunny and Cher Comedy Hour. The Old Housewives Bulge. The Seven. For the Cinderella story, for the 750 and Ryder. One of the most beautiful machines. What a magnificent scrap these two are putting on for the crowd. Every time I put my hands on this motorcycle, I'm aware of the privilege and burden of owning a piece of history. 750 Super Sport is just one of the most sexy, iconic bikes. The Ducati 750 SS is a 70s benchmark. Some people say it is the most iconic bike of the 1970s. I didn't know what it was back then, but I always knew that these were going to be special bikes. Everyone is drawn so much to this one motorcycle. It's become a mystical thing, basically. <laughs> it's so beautifully made. It has everything that's right about it. It's color, it's noise, it's shape, it's Italian. And the sound. The sound and the sound. The sound is magical. It was the most beautiful sound coming out of a motorcycle I had ever heard. Inside of the motor is music. It was an engine from a different era. That's the Desmodronic. Desmodronic. Desmodronic valves just wants to go faster and faster and faster. And when you hit 6,000, 7,000 RPMs, game over. Yeah, they're an artifact, aren't they? There's still nothing like it. And it is the icon of Ducati. It would not be an understatement to say that Ducati, as we know them today, wouldn't exist without that bike. It is a race bike in street trim. Get that thing up to about 130 miles an hour and it's in a sweet spot. Beautiful, fast, great handling. Wow. If you own one, you know. If you've never ridden one, it's like you've never ridden a motorcycle when you ride. I don't know of any others like this actually anywhere. There is a story for every motorcycle and Keith's is unique. Would you die for your bike, Keith? Would I die for my bike? Oh. I would take a beat down. <laughs>